Big Sandy Community and Technical College's Workforce Solutions is making strides to focus more on students and local businesses. They will be offering free consultations for their training programs to ensure the local economy is doing well. Mountaintop News spoke with BSCTC Director of Business and Industry Development Joyce Wilcox to hear more. Workforce Solutions, okay, that is a little different from the academic side of the house. We primarily work with employers that either are looking to hire new people for pre-hire training or for uh, additional training for their current employees. Appalachian Wireless was one of the uh, employers that we worked with recently and they were looking for customer service, sales and leadership training. Uh, we were fortunate enough to uh, hire Mavis Williamson, who is new to our t adjunct team, and she was able to provide the customer service training recently, and we got great evaluations from the employees there. Save for back to school on your own terms. That's Forward Pay at Appalachian Wireless. Get $75 off select Forward Pay devices on any Forward Pay plan. No contract, no credit check. Forward Pay. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. Joining the training program is quick and easy by contacting the Workforce Solutions office. Staff at BSCTC will work to create a curriculum appropriate for any client. We have a discussion with the employer about the training that they need, um, and we ask them what time frame, within what time frame they need the training delivered. We ask them if they already have a curriculum developed. If they do not, then we will work with them to develop that curriculum. Um, at that point, once we have um, gathered the information that's needed, we will provide a proposal which will show the total cost of the training and what that training will be with the discount. Uh, it's a very simple process. It doesn't really take, you know, it just depends on the employer really, but 10, 15 minutes and we can um, have enough information to uh, develop that proposal. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.